When I say bananas, you say peppers. Probably shouldn't be waving scissors around dramatically like that. Today, you guys, we have more. Ah, oh, now I have to do the dramatic stab again. Look at this, look at this. Today we have ha, more $5 footlongs, $5 Michaels grab bags. They should call them grab boxes. <laughs> All right. <gasps> I feel like, I feel like I'm kind of out of breath. I just ran up and down the stairs three times because you guys can't see it now, but I've got three of these boxes today. Let me simmer down for a second. Sippy, sippy. <sighs> oh my God. You know who used to say simmer down? Stick stickly. Do you guys remember Stick Stickly? I think that they do this once a month. They put out these $5 grab bags. They are these pretty big brown boxes full of items. There's like whole communities of people that keep tabs on when they're gonna drop these things in the store. People wait in the parking lot, run inside, grab as many as they can. I would not have known that these we're about to come out unless my friend had texted me. Uh, my friend, Melissa, you guys probably know her as the cheap chick on YouTube. She told me like, tomorrow's the day, go get your Michaels grab bags. Box number one, we're gonna start standing and then we're gonna sit. So I paid $15 for three boxes that cost $5 a piece. And for each box, I'm gonna tabulate, if I can, and see like what the retail value of all the items added together would have been. And then I think just for fun, I'll do, it's raining outside. Um, Just for fun, I'll do like a grand grand total at the end of like, I paid $15, I got blank dollars of merchandise. Oh my God, did we just get the same thing? over and over again. Brace yourselves. Quite apparently, I'm gonna be entertaining a lot of people because look at these plates, you guys. Did I just get, I mostly got a box of plates. Look at that. Whoever put this together was really wanting to make sure whoever got this box got a lot of plates. Now don't get me wrong, I mean, these are great. Who doesn't need plates? So they all say Happy Valentine's Day, and wow, they all had a retail value of $5.99. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve plates. All the same, Happy Valentine's Day. I mean, they're cute! And to go with those plates, what do you think we're gonna need? I hope the answer is napkins. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Eight things of Valentine's Day napkins. These retailed for $4.99. And they're cute. Spread love to complete our table. <laughs> what do you think we need next? If you said forks, that would be very logical, but that's not what's in this box. We've got table covers. We have four. Four identical red heart table covers. And actually, these are probably, for me, the thing I'm most excited about so far in this box, because I love to get chi table covers like this for when I'm doing like crafting projects. Like if I'm gonna be, you know, tie dyeing a lot of stuff, or one time very recently, I tried to tie dye a t-shirt with Halloween candy. And you better believe um, I needed plastic covering you guys, an eyelash has just fallen right directly into my eyeball. So uh, four tablecloths that retailed for $3.99. Okay, okay, let me take care of that eyelash and then we'll have an exciting conclusion to this box. I'm back. I'm not sure that I got it, but the show must go on. All right, up next, I'm gonna show you guys an item which is an enigma to me. What is this? What is it for? Where did it come from? This a drawer or something? Like it pulled out of something? You guys, no price. It's got like a magnet on the back. Oh my God. You guys, this was definitely maybe just like broken off of something and they were like, you know what? Just chuck it in the box. Oh, it's crushed. <laughs> 
that's still cute. Um, I was gonna say, probably the thing I'm most excited about is this little heart-shaped box. $2.99. It's cute. It's paper. I feel like I could put, like, jewelry in it, or maybe my five very favorite mini brands. So give me just a minute. I'm gonna tabulate the value of all of our napkins and paper plates, and then I'll tell you guys what the retail value of this box is, and then we'll move on to the next box. So I'll see you guys down there. By down there, I don't mean hell. I just mean the floor. Welcome back. For that first box, I got a retail value of $130.75. I think it was like $71 of plates alone. I didn't even count our mystery enigma of a random shelf. I didn't know like what value could I possibly assign to that. I'm just kind of hoping to see more variety in this box. Ooh! Ow! One, two, three more stacks of paper plates. Plates. Is there more in here? $5.99, exact same design. This is covered in craft glitter. Oh, but this is kind of cool. It's, kinda, it's, it's looking a little crunchy. I'm not gonna lie. It's looking a little covered in glitter, which is kind of, you know, this is a $15 item. So I've honestly always wanted to make one of these. I've seen people do them in all shapes and by all, I mean, I usually see rectangles, squares, and hearts, but these are called a memory explosion box. Let's go ahead and uh, look away from the glitter. Unfortunately, this one looks like it was kicked around a bit. And then I think you go, that was very anticlimactic. Do I not know what's supposed to happen here? I thought you like open this up and then, I mean, clearly the design is there. I thought that it was kind of weird that it was just made out of like paper like this. Cause I think normally they have to have like cardboard or something attached to them so that the bottom is a little bit heavier because when you open it, you're supposed to like, like one layer at a time is supposed to fall open. I don't know, the thought was there, the execution, not so much. Up next, let's go ahead and just get through more glitter, shall we? Ooh, ooh there's exciting things in here. Okay, um, I think we just have three sets of this. This looks like the only other directly frighteningly glitter item in here. So these are giant heart stickers. I mean, honestly, these are really awesome. If you have somebody in your life that loves craft glitter, this would be a moment for them. So you get 24 pieces in each pack. They retail for $4.99. Breaking it up with a little St. Patrick's Day items. We have two clover cookie cutters. I don't know why I saw this and I immediately thought like Girl Scouts. Isn't there simple like a clover? So these retailed for $1.99 a piece. We have two piles of napkins in here. One more is the exact same set that we got eight of last time, $4.99. Then we got these like larger rectangular serving napkins and these retail for $5.99. Up next, I have two identical like wall hanging signs. Love, love. Although they are like clearly meant to be um, for Valentine's Day, I feel like, you know, some people just love the love aesthetic. These retailed for $14.99 a piece. Very cute, kind of metal, metally. Ha! ASMR. Oops. So we got another one of those um, dual glitter heart things. I think that there's just two in there that are like this. So these are for scrapbooking or pictures or whatever you want to do with them. They are just like little banners, ba banners, banners, stickers, stickers that look like banners. And these retail for $2.99 a piece. They are metallic. They are cute. And they're slightly three dimensional. I'm not sure how well you guys are going to be able to see that or not. Ooh, I'm going to open these because I love these and they do look glittery. And I do, I love glitter, but I love it when it's like encapsulated in a thick layer of plastic. $4.99 
for these stickers. So they are like three dimensional, very sparkly heart stickers. These are amazing. <gasps> these are hands down my favorite thing. So once again, these are like a specialty kind of sticker. They feel really thick, like cardstock. They are metallic. They are adorable. And I also just feel like some of them that are like you and me be kind, like they don't necessarily like only have to be for Valentine's Day, the red hearts. So once again, these retail for $2.99. Moving on to the thing that I'm really excited for. This just seems like it would be really fun. I've never done a project like this. They are mugs that you can, this one does say color in, but it looks like there's little paints in here. You paint it yourself and then you bake it in the oven and you have a mug. It's actually really cute. Even though it's in like Valentine's Day packaging, I don't really know what is like inherently a Valentine's Day about this because it's an adorable little unicorn and it says kindness is magic. This retailed for only $5.99. You guys, how does Michaels do its pricing? Like I feel like this is like so much more like fancier than like I don't know, the metal sign we saw that was like $15, I don't know. Up next we have many duplicates, these kind of things in here, but I'm just gonna show you guys like design by design. This one is a heart shape color in ornaments and it does say happy Valentine's Day. So I think, yeah, so you get one wood ornament with string, five glitter foam stickers, and three markers. So cute little kits. I mean, I, I need to find somewhere that I can donate stuff like this to. $3.99 and we got four. Oh my God, this, this is honestly so cute. These are the same thing, one wood ornament, seven glitter foam stickers, and three markers. Once again, $3.99. And this is this cute like cat and dog. Look at that cat's face though. He's up to something. I can't conceal my joy any longer for these many, many rolls of wasabi tape. All the same designs, but you know what? This is a little bit, you know, just dipping your toe in planner land, stationary land. You get um, five rolls and it looks like you honestly get you know, a considerable amount of tape. So I'm sure you guys can see the designs, very cute. I mean, I think my favorite is like just the plain heart ones. Red glitter, I don't, but the glitter doesn't seem to like come off that much. I don't know, forever I've wanted to do. And I know like so many of y'all are like, just do it, don't get bogged down by the details. I've always wanted to do a Bujo. And I always wanted to do at least like a month of like Dracula theme Bujo. So I'm like, I need like red supplies. So they say Valentine's Day, I say Dracula. $5.99 and we got four of them. Something that looks adorable and I don't know what it is, but I like the face on it. So this is a Valentine's mailbox kit. It does not include the box. So I guess you can make this like front design, which is really cute. It's got like a crown and like a, I don't, there's something that's like 90s looking about this. I don't, I don't know why. Faces only happened in the 90s. Foam shapes, stickers, pom poms, paintbrush, paint marker. So quite a bit of stuff in there. Which I mean, once again, if you got this in a box like this and you were just kind of like a crafty person, I could see we're just like having these supplies on hand. Like you don't necessarily have to make like that exact thing, you know? Two other things. Oh, this is twine. See, once again, I feel like not just Valentine's Day because I feel like I only think of twine at Christmas when I'm like wrapping up presents. Ah! I was like, what is shaking about in here? You guys. Silica gel packet. Why? Red and white, candy cane. So you get four bundles of twine. These retail for $4.99 a piece. Um, we got something else that's like very similar to those things, but this is called a garland, but it's basically the same like twine kind of stuff, except for this one has pom poms and felt hearts. I don't know what I would like use this for necessary. Do people like wrap gifts for Valentine's Day? Are we like the only ones over here just not wrapping our Valentine's Day gifts? Well, you know what? I do like baskets a lot of times, but I don't like 
wrap it and like tie it with twine. $4.99 felt garland. Oh, this is kind of cute. It is glitter, but um, I would call this more like confetti. Like if you were going to decorate the table with all your Valentine's Day napkins, uh, plates, and tablecloths, you could like spread this out. And I honestly really like the heart-shaped bottle as well. And um, hopefully you guys can see the design. They're like these little hearts trapped in there, $4.99. Up next, we've got one random cookie cutter. Is this like Christmas? Is this like a poinsettia? A snowflake? Look at that. I live in Texas. I don't know what a snowflake is. It's probably a snowflake. It doesn't tell me directly. It just says Christmas. Noel. $2.99 for this cookie cutter. And you know, why not? We're gonna have some poinsettia snowflake cookies. Up next is this thing, which I guess, I guess is a, a decorative bottle. I thought maybe like something was inside the box. Is this broken glass? I don't know. Broken glass. Interesting. It's not like fully broken, but like uh, $5.99. Lastly, but not leastly, we got more kitchen stuff. $2.99 for these little muffin cupcake things. So once again, let me take many minutes and calculate all this up and I'll give you guys a total for box number two. Whew! That was more math than I've done since high school. That box totaled one ninety one sixty three. That is a lot of retail value for five dollars. <laughs> sippy sippy. <sighs> Time to get into box number three. I just kind of can't believe, honestly, that they put so much stuff in them. I mean, I know that obviously this is like older seasonal stuff. So obviously it would have been like on clearance in the store and stuff. But I mean, still, Woo! this one looks jam crammed again i see some different things and some duplicates you guys we got more napkins i see that right off the top we got another one of these boxes this one is in like slightly better condition than the last one once again 14.99 another familiar face that i see in here there might be more of these down there but two of the same packages of rectangular napkins you get 24 napkins in each of the, I don't think we're gonna need to buy napkins for the rest of the year. $5.99. Oh my gosh. These are adorable. What is the purpose of these? I guess you can place like one cupcake on here. You get 12 of these adorable, like teddy bear sized plates. $3.99 for these. I'm probably most excited about these so far, just cause I think these would be great for like TikTok, baby Shrek. Oh! <laughs> My God, these are hilarious. Three of these headbands. This is like just every theme all rolled into one. It's St. Patrick's Day unicorns, fuzzy unicorn ears, green unicorn horns, $7.99. I'm like so intrigued by these because I see at least two of them and I like just genuinely don't know what they are. Pillows that hang off of, I don't know. And they say forever and uh, $5.99 for the mini hanging pillows. I feel like I'm just looking at everything oddly because I'm like, oh, it's not, it's not a Halloween decoration. I just, I don't, like, honestly, we really decorate for Halloween first and foremost and then Christmas. So I'm just like, but I bet there's people out there that decorate for like Valentine's Day. Up next, we have ribbon galore. Do you need ribbons? Do you need clover ribbons? You get nine foot of um, this clover ribbon. They are $3.99 a piece. And we got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, 10, 11, 12, 13. Also seeing some other ribbons in here, but I think we just got one 
of each of these designs. So this one is pretty cute as well. This one's also $3.99. You also get nine foot of this. It's a little bit thicker wired ribbon. We've got gold clovers, green clovers. And then this one is like my personal favorite just because I think it has like a little bit of a retro vibe to it. $3.99 as well. That's crazy. How is this? And this, both $3.99, I don't know. Nine foot. This has like daisies and shamrocks. I see more baking cupcake cups, which I feel like we're gonna get so much use out of these. We love muffins and cupcakes. We have three 24 piece packs of these shamrock. I keep wanting to call them clover. What is honestly the difference between a clover or a shamrock? Or is it the same thing with two different names? Uh, $2.99, 24 pieces. All becoming a Valentine's Day blur to me now. I think we got these, but they were smaller. It was a different design. So I think that these are slightly larger Valentine's Day um, muffin cups. Once again, what does that say? $2.99? Up next is something that I'm like genuinely excited about. I'm trying to see if there's like more than one. It's a, a balloon bouquet. But some of the balloons are like the clear kind with the hearts in it. Which once again, I feel like, you know, you could use that for like anniversary or something else. $3.99. You get six pieces, but you get the ribbon which is like this red hollow kind of stuff. Really pretty. Oh, this is what I saw. I thought I saw another balloon bouquet. I cannot believe that this is in here. This is a $20 balloon garland kit. I've always wanted to do one of these for Halloween. It's six foot and you make one of these things and it actually even has this like one that says love, all these different balloons. I mean, look at that. This has a lot of pieces in it. A hand tool. I don't know what that means, but look, that's pretty cool. A $20 item in here. I'm gonna gather all of this thing. I don't even know what this is. We have a couple different designs. These are a card kit, but look at this. There's like little dots of paint. I don't know. We got four of these, $2.99. The design is very cute. It says kindness matters. You know what? I'm just gonna open one. You get an envelope. <gasps> Happy Valentine's Day. But look at this. It's like all these paint dots that I guess you use water and just like spread the dots around. I don't know, you get this tiny little paintbrush and a marker to I guess draw or write or whatever. I don't know, pretty cool, pretty cool. So we got four like that. And then we got three like this, which is the unicorn. It's the same design that we saw earlier in the mug. It says kindness is magic. A familiar friend. We got a bunch of these things in the same designs as last time. I need to make friends with like a teacher because I feel like this is like, I definitely have like 12. 24 of these. How many kids are like in a class these days? Eight more of these um, wooden ornament kits in the same designs. So we've got the dog and the cat and the heart. And this is something different, which looks really cool. It's called a heart sculpture kit. So for $14.99, you make three of these like hanging ornaments. You know what I'm noticing now is, do they only put like Michael's brand items in these things? So I think we only get one set of these in here, but pretty cute. You get a set of six mini Valentine's Day bags, which once again, I guess that's like what I associate all of this kind of stuff with is like, if you're doing like class parties or something and you need to pass out like 24 Valentines or something like these would be so cute to do and like put little candies or something in. Six more banner sticker sets. We saw these before $2.99. Found another set of bags, same design. So now we have 12 bags, $4.99. This is something different that I think we only got one of, and it's a two piece set of treat boxes. That's really cute. $2.99, and you can fold up these little boxes, put cookies or candy inside of them. Okay, this, I don't know what it is. It's a card kit 
$14.99. You can make four cards. You get a little thing of blue and that's what the cards look like. I guess you can make like these three dimensional flowers on the front. Up next, a familiar friend. We got two more sets of that same twine ah, silica gel, uh, $4.99. Then we got, oh, our Girl Scout cookie cutter again, $1.99. And two more things of the same wasabi tape for $5.99. And this is going to be the longest video ever. Um, another thing of that same type of confetti, $4.99. Um, another bottle, this time not broken, $5.99. That's pretty cute. I mean, I know a lot of people like to decorate with these kind of bottles. And then we have this. Oh, it just says, it says lucky. Oh, this is actually like kind of, it's actually kind of cool, honestly. Um, it looks like a gift tag. It says lucky and it kind of has like, this feels like metal. It is metal. That's why it feels metal. So this is like metal on the top, um, like pretty thick wood on the back. That's pretty cute. Um, $9.99 for that. We have more of those um, stickers that we saw before the giant hearts where you get pink and red, um, $4.99. And then more napkins that we're hiding, the same rectangular napkins, $5.99. And then we have one thing that's like this. It's a card kit and this is like really cool. It almost looks like you do a stained glass effect with tissue paper and $2.99. And we have two of these card kits for $2.99. Really similar to the last one I just showed you guys, except for instead of tissue paper, this one has glitter. And uh, two things left in the box, the same but different. So these are like the little picks for cupcakes or muffins. And we have these that are really cute metallic hearts. They say like love XOXO. I think that one says sweet. And you get how many? Oh, 12 pieces. Hello. Um, and these are also probably one of my favorite designs. So they're little envelopes with metallic hearts on them. And once again, cupcake picks. So cute. Okay. That's it in the box. So once again, let me tabulate and we'll do another grand total. All right, you guys, third box total is in and it honestly blew me away. Retail value of this box, $352.28. You guys, I had no idea what was in these boxes, but it's kind of cool how we just kept getting like higher dollar stuff and like better stuff in each box as we went along. For all three boxes, I paid $15 and the total combined retail value, $674.66. I feel like we got some really, really cool items. I mean, literally only one thing was broken and I started to think about it. They probably didn't put it in the box broken. Well, oh, two things was broken. Mysterious shelf from box number one. If anybody knows what that is, leave me a comment down below. But I'm starting to think, you know, it was in there with some of those larger metal wall hanging signs. So maybe that's how it got broken in transport or something. Who knows? Out of three boxes, I mean, we got some really awesome stuff. And I even started to think like, if I didn't want them to be like St. Patrick's Day themed, like I could take off like the shamrocks and stuff. I don't know, do a little bit of DIY, get creative. I definitely want to do this again. I wish I could time it to find the Halloween stuff because nothing would bring me more joy than a $5 box of skeletons. Thank y'all so, so much for hanging out today and for watching. If you're not already and you'd like to be, hit the button down below, subscribe, become a member of the Banana Pepper Squad today. And until I see you guys again, which is going to be very, very soon, stay happy, stay healthy, stay sassy, stay banana peppery. I love you guys so, so much and I'll be back. Bye!